First thing that I need to do is maybe apologize for not starting this sooner. We were a day into this project before we realized that maybe this is something that, uh, you know, you would be interested in, getting a dock into a swamp environment. It's not like putting a dock on the lake. You know, the swamp is always moving. And where's the bottom? It might be three feet down. You might have 10 feet of silty stuff. In the case where this dock was going, it's two feet of water and then three more feet of real heavy silt. So we needed the ability to adjust uh, so we could continually put pressure down on the posts that support the dock. Now, if you want to go with styrofoam to float a dock, that one's easy, but it's really expensive. You can spend a thousand bucks really fast for styrofoam billets or sheet stock. If you're going to support a dock with posts, you have to have the ability to adjust it, to level the thing, because in a swamp, it's going to sink. That The bottom is always somewhere else down there. We punched test holes with a chisel where this dock was going to go to see what we had underneath. We had two feet of water and then we had three feet of real heavy silt. So why are we out here at the power line if I'm telling you about putting a dock across the swamp? These two poles are new. The two that used to be here, I got. What you missed was taking the two poles, dragging them through the woods on the woods trail out to the west end of the lock where the kid's family cabin is and putting those two poles, pushing them out onto the ice because the ice was already busting up. I got a little ways out there with the tractor and the thing started, <laughs> I had to push them out there. We got them set five feet center to center and then the kids put the dock boards out there and this is where we pick it up. Dock boards in place, poles out on the lake, and then we bring in the steel support system to pick it up, to carry it, and then adjust with the adjustability out on that uh, boggy surface or the boggy swamp.
they didn't quite fit. But that's what chainsaws were made for. Making itty bitty tiny little adjustments. What are you doing, Papa? What? What are you doing with the chainsaw? Making a tiny little adjustment. You're supposed to be being quiet, remember? Push it. I think if we just go through and straighten these posts out, lift it up a little bit more, we can call this good. Or maybe perfect, as in Perfect, sufficient onto the requirement of the job thereof. Does that look more gooder? Yeah. Okay. I think I want a cheater bar for this. We're gonna go get a pipe to put on there. I'll probably drop the bananas on the way. Because my toes they are freezing. They're freezing? Yes, I am.